Greetings everybody, this is Mishi and Amber from Grooveroo Dance and we're here for day number two of our Tularu tour video blog. Yesterday we talked a little bit about why we're excited for the tour and today we'd like to share about why we think it's important to dance with your baby. Yeah, so one of the most common questions that we get is when should I start dancing with my baby? And for us the answer is when you're pregnant. I was yep. um, lucky enough to find out that um, we got pregnant right when we started the business so I was able to dance with Eamon um, right from the start and it's just really cool because they're learning about all of your rhythms when they're in the womb um, your heartbeat and the rhythm of your walking and then they get a different rhythm when you're dancing and then there's just a really nice continuation that happens after they're born there's still so much development going on so with them being in the carrier they still get to hear your voice and feel your heartbeat and feel your rhythms and then um, be exposed to you dancing and feeling the rhythm of you dancing as well, which is just a really, really lovely connection. So it's a little bit like the continuum concept, right? I mean, what yeah. they were experiencing inside, they're gonna continue to experience a similar thing outside. Exactly. So. And that's, it makes an easier transition for the baby as well. Cool, for me, um, the one of my motivations for uh, dancing with Eamon is I really want him to be exposed to rhythm and music from a very early age so that you know I, I told Amber I only have two uh, goals for Eamon I don't care if he's the smartest kid in class or the most talented kid I just want him to be kind and I want him to have a good rhythm and so I've been lucky enough to be travel in different cultures like Cuba and Brazil where dancing is the norm for both men and women and rhythm is not an issue so it's very interesting to be in America where I teach dance and have so many people and especially men have so much fear and uh, trouble with rhythm and how do we get to a culture where we're almost arrhythmic or fear of rhythm and so I feel like it's very important rhythm is very important because it's not about connecting to the music alone Rhythm is a way to connect with other people, and when you yeah. move together, you're bonded with them. Mm -hmm. So we even noticed that in class with our babies, the baby because we were moving with our babies. Not only are the moms bonded together, but the babies are bonded together because the common rhythm means a common community, and that's what we're trying to build. Absolutely. So that's why rhythm and dancing is important from the very start. Definitely. So one thing that we like to do at the beginning of our classes, we just wanted to share with you today. So if you have your baby around, you can go ahead and pick them up and put them on your body, whether they're in a carrier or not. And then together, we're just going to take a nice inhale. So inhaling. Yeah. And let's do that one more time. Inhale. Oh, yeah, let it all out. And just taking a moment to feel the connection of you and your baby together and feeling their heartbeat with your heartbeat yeah. and their rhythm with your rhythm. So that's the connection you feel. That's an important thing to do before you actually start dancing with your baby. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow we're actually going to learn a dance together. Yay. Are you excited? So we're going to give yeah. you a little bit of, yeah, I'm yeah. super excited too. We're going to a little bit of preview of what we do so that you know we're, uh, you, yeah. what you're going to be getting yourself into when you come to our classes. So again, if you like what we do and are interested in coming, please sign up for our workshops at the link above and we look forward to seeing all of you and dancing with you tomorrow. Awesome. So until tomorrow. Until tomorrow. Bye. See you later.